All right, we're back here with a TED Talk on Global Goals 2019, Copenhagen. We have the first secretary of the Embassy of Sweden, Cecilia Laveau. Hi, nice to meet you. Good to meet you. How are you doing today? Cold. Yeah, a little, a little chilly. But really good, really good. Warming up. Warming up. This is an amazing event. Tell us about your involvement with uh, Global Goals 29 and Copenhagen. And well, we have a fantastic Swedish team here tonight. Yeah. So we watch them play, and we hope that they will win and get to New York. That's the plan, right? Yeah. We'd like to know how, how can the sport help build bridges across borders, and are athletes also a kind of ambassadors? I think sports has enormous potential to build bridges across borders. Sure. I mean, sports is the language that everybody can talk and understand, and as such, I think sport can build bridges not only across physical borders, but also borders, mental borders, such yep. as language, culture, ethnicity, whatever, really. So I think the potential is enormous. Yeah. But I think we shouldn't forget that sports, they're as embedded in the society that they are in as any other part of society. Yeah. So it also mirrors the society. So we shouldn't expect sports to just solve our problems. Right. But I think we can achieve a lot through sports. Yeah. So the uh, potential is enormous, but it doesn't do it by itself. And uh, what do you see as the potential of achieving gender equality? I think we have come quite a bit, but there's a long way to go. Obviously, yeah, I mean, I, Sweden and Denmark are always scoring at the top positions in the yeah. world, really, and also in the EU. But we still have a lot to do to achieve gender equality also in our countries. How does Sweden view the link between the European Union and sustainable development? Oh, I mean, the world needs more cooperation to achieve the goals, not less, obviously. So yeah. the European Union is our platform as is the United Nations, but the U European is the, definitely the most important platform because we cannot achieve the global goals alone. We need to do it together. Like a team playing football. Huh? We have to keep doing it. Definitely. I, I just wanted to know, where, do you, uh, where does Sweden see themselves uh, getting involved with the global goals in the next couple of years? Oh, well, global goals, obviously, we just, I mean, we have a feminist foreign policy. I think the only country in the world that has a feminist foreign policy. Yeah. So Sweden is taking it seriously, and we are we are out there. We are really yeah, working yeah. to achieve this issue in the, in the world. So, yes, continue our good work. Well, thank you so much. Thank you.